Hello oh. Before we begin the video, let's discuss Cloud Foundation. Cloud Foundation is the premier online training platform to help individuals and organizations gain knowledge and skills in the ever-growing cloud computing industry. Let's start with the settings in the today's session. So, once we go into the settings, this is the end user page. And these all tabs which you are seeing in the left side, these are the end user tabs. All these tabs which you are seeing is the end user tabs. Most importantly, there are certain tabs where the configuration is there in the background. There are certain configurations which are there in the background. So those configurations we need to understand from a consultant point of view. So in the end user, whenever they work on certain tabs, when they are performing certain actions, performing that action, there is a configuration which is there in the background. So, as a consultant, we should know where is the configuration, because at any point of time, if an user is facing some issue in term of that particular tab, then we have to help them and we should know how to resolve it. So, we will go and discuss on each tab. Most importantly, some of the tabs we can able to ignore. Some are important tabs. So among these, some of the important tabs are, one is password, one is notification, one is change language and then you have one more tab which is not reflecting right now. That is called as a proxy. I will show you. And other tabs. We can go just an overview, but this is least important in term of that particular tab. Okay. So here, let's start here. First of all, the password. So when you go into the success factor system, when you go into the first tab, that is a password. Generally for the end user, they used to get a notification. Once in 60 days that their password has to getting expired and the password has to what is called reset the password by themselves. Okay. So when they have to reset the password, there is certain password policies. Okay. And this according to the password policy. Only the password has to be reset. Okay. Who will reset the password? That individual users. Whoever the end users are there, those end users will reset the password. Okay, but this is the page where they are going and resetting the password. But for resetting the password nearly one SAP customer. SAP recommends customer should always reset the password policies. They say there are certain password policies. Okay. Where is those password policies located? That is important from a consultant point of view. Okay. So from the end user point of view, this is the page which I am just showing you. Okay. So when I duplicate the screen, I will show you how we can, where the password policies are defined. You can understand the password policy right. Password policy means what is the how many characters it has to take. It is a case sensitive or not. Capital letter is required or not. Special characters. It is required or not. So all these conditions will be there in the password policy. Okay. And time to time this password policy has to be changed on the customer side.
Okay. So let me see. Manage external password policy. Okay. So you can see, certain password policies are there and this password policies has to be controlled from the admin side. Time to time not frequently, but at least yearly once. And according to this password policy, once this password policy is being defined and it is being reset for the new year. First of all, they have to send a communication mail internally that the password policy has been changed and the new policy, which is a new policy and according to the new policy, only you have to, you have to define the new password. Okay. So whenever the password policy has to change, either the consultant will either the admin from the customer side will do or the customer will tell to us as a consultant that please do the change of the password policies. Okay. So we have to do it at least yearly once. Once this password policy has been changed, then we need to inform to the end users. And after informing to the end users, end users can able to go and change the password from here. Okay. This is the end user page. This is the admin page. Who will be accessing the admin page? The consultants. Who are the consultant? The success factor consultants. Who are the success factor consultants? Consultants like us who are getting trained, certified and have experience and working on the projects. You should know how the password has to be. Password policy has to be resetting the password. See who will reset the password. Who are into success factor environment right? Okay. So whoever are the live employees means actual employees for the customer. They are located in the, in the production environment. Okay, development environment and the preview environment who are using? We consultants are using right. For doing the configuration and for the testing purpose. Okay. So we do all these configurations in the development preview and then we move it into the production. So there are certain key users who will be working, who will be working on the development and the preview. So for them also we it is required to reset the password policies. Okay. And live environment. That is 4,000 to 5,000 employees who are working in them. So that they will be working in the live environment, that is, into the production environment. Okay. So for them, we also need to inform to them that the password policies have been changed. So now, later on, after one month or 60 days, when you will get a notification that the password has to be reset, then they have to follow the new policy, not the old one. Got it. So now coming into the start page, this is the second page. Okay. So this is least important. But still, when you are logging into the system, it is directing to the home page, right? When you log in with the ID password, it will be redirecting to the home page. Why it is redirecting to the home page? Because here the start page we have selected as home. Okay. Your start page, you're selected as home. You can see, the same links will be coming. How it is showing here also. 
So if I'm just taking something as a compensation. Okay. So here how you're taking as a compensation. I'm taking here as a compensation. I'm just taking on sale. Okay. Now, I'm just logging out. And finally do not forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel.